morning. Today's Monday of January. Um, I thought I'd do a weekly vlog because one of my goals this year is to get two videos up a week, whether it's on YouTube or um, Instagram. So here I am with Olivia, as ever. Um, we're just popping out. We are shooting this morning and then um, I'm then shooting later in town as well. So you can be in the background of my vlog, just taking some photos. Um, so, some flowers. Oh, I just wrote them. No, these are my two favourites. And now I'm just waiting for Kim at the hospital. Um, yeah. Oh my god, I'm home now. I, just, I don't know if any of you live in London, but I feel like when you've been in Central all day and you get on off the tube and like whatever, I just come out feeling like so disgusting and bedraggled and like sweaty and also cold and everything. Um, I bought myself some flowers today. I bought these pink anemones. I always just call them anemones, but I don't think that they're called that. Well, they're my favourite. I should probably know how to say them. And also, some parrot tulips, and three of them were snapped, and I'm really annoyed about it. These are what they look like. They're also up there in my favourite flowers. Look how weird they are. Um, these are the three snapped ones, so they're living in this tiny vase. On the windowsill in the kitchen, and then the other ones are in the other room. I don't really know what to do with these. I have so many vases and stuff, but not really a lot that suit like very skinny flowers that aren't in bouquets. So, we shall see. Um, not that it will make any sense unless you're kind of a flower guy, like I am, but these are really nice because they're on a really robust stem. Sometimes these can just be super heavy at the top and really wilty. Um, I know this isn't the right bar for them, but I don't actually hate it, so I'm just going to leave them in there for now and think about that tomorrow. They've been out of water all day while I've been in town, so they will do. Hopefully they'll uh, light, oh, lighten up as they open too, I imagine. So pretty. Morning. Today's Tuesday. God, I look so tired. Um, I am so tired. We have no heating or hot water. It's on like a joint system. Um, so even though we're not in a block of flats, we share heating. So we bought this, but we're not the freeholder. The freeholder has the heating. So we get it included in our service charge, which is great. But this is like the fourth time since we moved in a year ago that it's broken. So it's freezing. <laughs> um, it was so cold last night. No, oh my God. Hang on. Um, yeah, so that's not been great. Also, now I can tell you, um, you know I bought those parrot tulips yesterday. I was so excited about them. They cost me seven pounds, which is not cheap for tulips. And literally all bar three have snapped. Three. Um, I had them in a vase and one by one, they've literally all snapped and I have no idea why. This has never happened to me. I know obviously they're quite bulky and heavy at the top, but like, all of them to snap is really bizarre. Look, I'll show you, it's so sad. I just noticed another one. So I had to literally just fix one and these are all like, these were in one normal vase, as you saw. I've had to swap them out to all these stupid bud vases. These three have survived. Oh, another one. It's so annoying. Like, why are you all breaking? Ugh. You know, it's like, oh, it's not stainless Where do we go for? Should we do a palette? Oh, this one's cute. Yeah. I mean, it's all. I've been sent by your friend with a food apparently. I've been sent by your friend. It's still Tuesday. We've come to IKEA this evening because uh, Kim's picking up a new desk chair. So we're just pottering. Oh, Kim, here's the mirrors. And we're getting some bits of his family while we pick them up. I, um, we just got in and I just got out of the shower uh, while Kim makes dinner and watches Fulham. I've got a question for you. I sort of sat like that. That's my new acne jacket, which I'm going to be unboxing tomorrow. Right, this is our bathroom. It's horrible. I hate it. Um, we've got a big old shower here. It's actually like very newly done. It was done just before we bought the house, um, but I can't bear it. So, as I said, just had a shower. So, um, I... The best plan I think is to, and the toilet stayed, is to put a bath here. This is only a 140 
um, centimetre gap, but you can get a very small bathtub to fit in this gap. So that's what I'm gonna do with the shower, where it is now, but a new one. Um, pull out all these tiles, blah, 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 retile everywhere, fine. I hate this. This is the worst thing I've ever seen. But my dad tells me that there's pipes running along here, so we can't get rid of it and just put a nice standalone sink on a cute little wooden thing and a nice toilet. It has to be something, but I don't know. Like, I don't know what, like, I, I don't know how to design a bathroom. Like, how do you learn this stuff? So I literally have no idea. Is this making any sense? And basically, I don't want to go to, do people vlog in a towel? It's a bit weird, isn't it? I don't want to go to like Wix and be like, hey, I want a new bathroom. All the bits I want are a bit weird and all quite niche. The bath's really small for me to order it. So basically, I want to buy all the bits myself, find a plumber and find a tiler and get them to do it. But that means I don't know what I'm buying. Does this make sense? Like, where do you learn what type of toilet you need? Don't know. Anyway, that's my Tuesday. I will leave you there. I've got another Mindful Chef for dinner. Um, I actually worked with them a little while ago. So I've got £10 off your first two boxes. If you would like it, I'll leave the code in the box. Um, yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. Good morning. Happy Wednesday. I always wake up with my hair looking like this because I sleep with a pillow over my head. And I know that's the weirdest thing. But I can't sleep without it now. <laughs> Um, I'm about to go and release the hounds. I can hear them outside the door. Also, just find out on Instagram. If you have your, if you're a business or a creator account and you have your settings on your DMs not set to, if you have it to all requests, it doesn't show you all your messages. So I just found an absolute shit ton of brand DMs under top requests. So that was fun that I've missed over like three years. <sighs> Hello. Hi. Ow, fig. You know, that's like this, but I actually think if we can get away with it, we should use this like that. There you go. Yeah, there you go. I literally just like. I just. Yeah, I just think squeeze the shit out of it. Yeah, that's perfect. That's literally amazing. That is so. Come for a dog walk. So lovely. Look at the sun. It's so nice. Um, it's there's a Thursday. I only know that because it's New Invisalign Day, um, and today's also the day I've got to go to the dentist have a check up sorry this is a really unflattering angle but I'm too cold to hold my arm um just walking because I've got to shoot this morning for like an hour and then I'm gonna go and put it down into Brixton village and just sit down there and work for an hour or so then go to the dentist so we had all our recycling neatly here to go in the bin um, I've just come down and look at this. That's her dog food bag. What's that? What's that? Fig. What's that? <laughs> She's naughty. Oh God. Um, good morning. <laughs> it's Friday, finally. I don't know if I actually did any talking bits yesterday, but, um, I need a cup of tea. But, oh, can I put you up here? Oh no. Um, yes, today's Friday. I, I've got a pretty chill day today, which is so exciting. I feel like I've been so hectic this week. Um, I'm meeting Polly, who you might follow on Instagram, she's fab, for a dog walk. And then we're gonna go for some brunch and then, a little bit of work to do this afternoon with Olivia. I think that's it. That's it. It's a nice chilled day. Oh my collar's twisted. Um, yeah, so I can't wait for that. So I'm meeting Polly in just over an hour, I think. So I need a cup of tea and to 
not look like this. So we better click on. Good morning, today is Saturday. I'm just standing here in this funny little bra because I finally got my hands on the a gold pinch waist jeans. These are them. All my other gold jeans are so big. These are like loose on the waist. Not too much, they're livable. But like skin tight here, which is the bit I hate the most. And then fine on the leg. So part of me is like, do I keep them in the hopes that they'll give? Or do I just suck it in and send them back? I hate this. This does my head in. Oh, but other than that, um, I'm not doing anything exciting today. I'm going to go and take the dogs for a walk. And we've got dinner this evening with the friends. But that's about it. Bye-bye. I am so bad at vlogging like they I do them mainly because like I think it's a bit fun and like four people watch them so that's fine but every time I'm out I get like three quarters of the way through my activity and I'm like shit I'm vlogging <laughs> so um yeah that's always good fun anyway just went for a dog walk met Matt and Olivia and we just potted quickly and got a coffee and now I'm home um Kim is out today at a Fulham match so about one o'clock, I'm thinking I could pop to Sainsbury's and make myself like a nice shakshuka for lunch. That feels like a nice, like, self-care thing to do. <laughs> I'm going mad, aren't I? Um, yeah, so I might do that right now, I think. Otherwise, I won't do it at all. Um, what else? And then, I think I said earlier this evening, we've got dinner at Kim's friend's house. we our friends. Um, and then tomorrow, which is Sunday, Olivia and I have got a bar class at 11 and then I'm going to pop down to Chelsea for a wander and some lunch, I think, with my friend George. So I will round off tomorrow and then I'll just leave it at like a week. Um, and I, to be honest, I can't remember if I did anything of interest. But we move. Uh, yes, so I think I'm going to throw my shoes on and pop to Sainsbury's. And get... I'm going to just get some fresh cherry tomatoes, some chilli sourdough what else do i need got eggs got eggs okay chaotic our fridges at the moment um i think that's all i need do i need that yeah for some reason the dogs are in their bed why are you in your bed it's not bedtime we have two beds for them which originally we bought two so that fig if she wanted her own bed when we got her she could have her own bed they never don't sleep together and for some reason they've just ended up like double deckered so like kim moves this into the kitchen at night so they can sleep like this you're very spoiled weird double decker bed also i figured someone might ask so i'm just gonna show you that i'm just freeballing this i'm just putting things i like in it um, so I'm going to do some red onion, garlic, cherry tomatoes, which will stew down, and then some fresh chilli, some chorizo, and then some uh, salt, pepper, paprika, coriander on the top, egg, sourdough. I've had a bit of chaos because midway through my um, shakshuka, basically, oh, well, God, it's such a long story. I just love a long story. I ordered some stuff from M&S and it auto defaulted to my old address, which I haven't lived in in like seven years. And I, I changed it. And then as I went to click pay, the page refreshed. So I was like, oh, for fuck's sake. So I put my details in, press pay. And as soon as I clicked pay, I was like, oh my God, did it default back again? Checked and it had. So I was like, bollocks. So literally straight away, I messaged M&S like, it's going to the wrong address, I don't know what to do. It's not even showing up on my account yet. Can you stop it? They didn't reply for like an hour and they were like, oh, sorry, it has to be within half an hour. I was like, well, so anyway, they were like, yeah, you're just gonna have to go and get it. I was like, very luckily, it's around the corner from where I live now because I've lived in the same place for 10 years. But what if I lived in Scotland now? So anyway, luckily, Kim went on a run the other day and I gave him a note that I'd written to put through the door for the people that lived there that were like, I'm really sorry, here's my number, please text me when it arrives. And luckily they did. So it just arrived today and the guy was like, yeah, do you, like, could you get it now? So I literally just... Put, turned the hob off, jumped in the car, ran around and got it. Um, and one of the things in there were these little mini fake Uggs. So I've got, I bought 
these as well the other day little like ganny um uh like tracksuit shorts i've lost the words but i've been living in them but how cute obviously everyone's gone like mini ug mad at the moment and i've worked with ug before on a paid thing ages ago and i was like oh cool and like whatever but then i haven't had uggs for years like i never really got into them the first time round, and then this time i was like oh i really want a pair but i just don't know if i'll commit to wearing them also i've got my birkenstock bostons which are like hideous brown shoes so i was like do i need two things like that so i didn't want to spend like 100 odd quid on them and these were 24.50 in the ms sale um they've still got most sizes so i'm sure they will tomorrow when this video goes up so i'll link them below but they're faux fur line, not sheepskin, but they're actually suede on the outside. So I'm very happy with them. I'm pretty sure I've done a good deed here. They're very comfy. I just, I look like a bit of a nutter right now, but that's fine. Anyway, I'm gonna plate up my shakshuka and finally eat it. Morning, today's Sunday. I'm gonna wrap this vlog up today, but um, it's about 10 to 11. Olivia and I are going to a bar class. So um, we're just gonna walk over now. I'm so nervous. It's the first actual workout class I've done since I had COVID in July because I got long COVID and I mean, I still got it. So <laughs> that's going to be fun. Um, but I need to try and get back into it. God, I'm so tired. But yeah, I'll let you know how it goes. Shoulders nice and heavy. Down away from your ears as you reach forward. Lovely. Four, 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 three, two, just trying some bits on in calls. My Georgia waits in the queue to return something in Zara. God, I am so tired. Oh my god, stay with me. Anyway, this is what I'm trying on. One of the things. I actually, I nearly bought it online. I just think it's really cute. I don't have anything like this. And you can tie it in a knot here. And I also tried this on, which is just like a navy sweatshirt, but I love it. I'm debating getting both. I really don't need both. I'm gonna try this on the next size up too. This one's a size small. Next one's this, which I literally love. It's so soft, but it's 180 pounds because it's cashmere. Don't need it. Don't need it, do I? But it's beautiful. Anyway. That's the end of today. I'm home now. I don't know what time it is. It must be like half six. Um, I'm back on the sofa. I've got my pajamas on. And um, I'm just gonna drink my cup of tea and then think about what to have for dinner because I have no idea. Before we start yet another week tomorrow. So I won't vlog next week. I just think I'll do this like ad hoc. But as always, please let me know if you enjoyed it, if there's anything in particular that you wanna see because I have no idea what to use this channel for. So yes, uh, I hope you enjoyed, oh, and I will see you soon.